What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the, smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is the free general collective reading, capsule side to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. It doesn't apply that it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Free general collective reading um, for all signs. Um, it's very important to only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest, um, as this is a collective reading. One message may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply, only you know your story, not anybody else, okay? Um, love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. We're 12,725 subscribers right now, so thanks so much for all the love and support to your channel. I truly appreciate it. Okay, so I'm just going to dive into it because I've gotten a ton of channelings today. Um, so this is the last one unless I get another one, but um, the channeling I received was um, Several people that have recently received tarot card readings I heard in person um, from a particular feminine energy in a community is about uh, about to be really, really, really pissed at her because um, the readings she has done for them, none of it has turned out to be true. It has actually been opposite. Some people are going to request money back and she's going to refuse to give the money back. It's going to cause huge conflicts, is what I heard. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So there's some kind of tarot reader out in a community somewhere. Doesn't sound like they do it online. It sounds like they do it out, like, it sounds like they might do it at their house, or maybe they travel and go to other people's homes. Um, I don't know why you travel to go to other people's homes to do tarot card readings. Usually people come to you um, I didn't hear that she, uh, this person did. It's a femme energy that's doing this. I didn't hear she did. Um, people probably come to her. They probably travel to her. Because if I did them out in my community, you, they'd have to travel to me. And that's just the truth. I'm not traveling to somebody to do a damn tarot call reading for them. Um, my services are too precious. And that's just the damn truth. Um, they would have to travel to me, so I'm presuming they'd probably have to travel to her. You know what I'm saying? Um, but however that resonates, she does it out in her community. She's a feminine energy. But... Um, I heard the readings are not coming true. They're not coming true. They're actually coming opposite of what she's telling these people. Um, so I don't know if she's claiming she has abilities. I don't know. I didn't hear she said, I didn't hear that she is claiming she has abilities, but whether she's claiming she has abilities or not, the readings aren't coming true the way she's saying that they're going to basically. I heard, um, people are going to start asking for their money back. She's going to refuse to give the money back, it's going to cause huge chaos and conflict. I'm assuming for the ones that are going to ask for their uh, refund. Maybe you're one of these people that's about to ask for your refund back from one of these feminine energy uh, local community type tarot readers. Because uh, there's a reason I'm pulling this in, in here. So, um, But only you know you're swearing out anybody else. You have to plug it in how it resonates. But there's a reason I'm pulling this channel message in. So I'm feeling it's one of you guys, one of my subscribers or viewers, that is going to this local feminine energy tarot reader. Um, but she sounds like a fraud. She sounds like a fraud. She's actually a dark art spiritualist. One of these people is about to find this out very soon. Oh my God. Oh my God. I heard she's actually a dark art spiritualist. One of these people is about to find it out very soon. You plug it in, how it resonates. So, um, so yeah, I do. I feel... The reason I'm pulling it in is because you guys are going to this local feminine energy tarot card reader. She's in the 3D. She doesn't do a social media platform, it sounds like, um, is what I'm feeling. I think she does it out in her community. Um, but I heard she's actually a dark art spiritualist. And for one of you guys, one of you purveyors of her services there, um, you're about to find out she... Um, She's a dark art spiritualist. You might be one of the ones that's about to find that hoodoo, voodoo, secret um, altar um, that I just pulled in for the confirmations reading, possibly. Um, or not. Only you know your story, not anybody else. But I just did a confirmations reading right before this with a channel message of somebody's about to find a secret dark arts, black magic altar. And I don't think it's their altar they're about to find because obviously it's a secret hidden one that somebody was trying to keep hidden. So somebody's about to find it. It might be you about to find it in her home, possibly, for one of you guys. But only you know your story, not anybody else. I'm just kind of plugging in the pieces here. But you plug it in, how it resonates. We have um, Hex, Banishment, Reverse, Spirit, Initiation, Reverse.
was really giving this person the benefit of the doubt, but through many series of chain of events, you are about to expose this person in a huge way for the fraud they are. Oh, my Lord, you plug it in how it resonates. Dear God Almighty. I heard you were trying to give this person the benefit of the doubt, but through many series of chain of events, you're about to expose this person for the fraud they are. They are so that, Well, and honestly, they are frauding you. Um, they might have frauded somebody else. I'm feeling for some of you guys, you know they've frauded somebody else in the past. And you might expose that, or you just might expose the fact they frauded your ass. Um, or both, however that resonates. Only you know you're sorting out anybody else. But I'm feeling for some of these femme tarot cards, Dark art, spiritualist, hoodoo, voodoo, fake, light side, wannabes over here. That basically, they don't sound like they know what the hell they're doing. And I'm just being for real. And I'm not, I'm not trying to be mean. I'm really not trying to be mean, but I'm just being real. Because I always keep it real on here. Y'all know that. I don't think this feminine energy knows what the hell she's doing. And I'm just being serious. I'm truly serious about this. I don't think she knows what the hell she's doing. And I think you're about to, you're highly intuitive. You're about to pick up on this. Um, but I heard you were trying to give her the benefit of the doubt, but you're about to quickly realize she basically doesn't know what the hell she's doing or talking about. Um, so banishment reverse, you were trying not to banish her from your life. You were trying to give her a benefit of doubt with services purveyed from her. But um, I think once you pick up on the fact that she's not even going to want to give you back her, the refund, that is going to um, obviously create conflict there. And it would create conflict with me too, because I'd want my refund back too. Um, absolutely. freaking lootly. Um, and the fact maybe when you guys find a dark arts voodoo hoodoo altar up in there possibly for one but whether you find a voodoo hoodoo dark arts altar or not you're going to want your money back that's going to create conflict you were trying to give her the benefit of the doubt but um none of the shit's coming true whatever she's speaking about or reading in the cards or telling you or what have you she is a local community reader She's not an online person, whoever this person is. I'll tell you that right now. Um, that you're pervading here, whoever you are. Initiation reversed. About to realize very, very, very quickly the truth of things. Huge exposure coming. Okay. I heard uh, about to quickly realize the truth of things. Huge exposure coming. So you're about to expose her. And I heard it in here earlier. You were going to expose her basically once she refuses to give you back the money. And you realize none of the shit that she told you. In the pay, and it's a paid reading, um, whoever you are. You're about, you're about, you either have already paid her for services or you're about to. How that resonates. But um, none of it's. None of it's either about to come true or already has come true. But however that resonates, she's a fraud. She's a fraud. Um, so you're about to expose her. She has not been initiated truly into the spiritual realm. She's not of the light. She's, I mean, she's not of the light. I mean, and I, I hate to say that, but I'm serious. Um, I heard she was secretly dark arts. I mean, she is a dark arts fraud of... Uh, of the light is what she is. Um, whether you find a altar or not. And I mean, I hate to say that, but it's the truth. Um, and I'm just being for real. That's what I'm feeling from the channel messages and the cards here. She's trying to come off like she is a light side spiritualist, but she's really not. She really practices dark arts in some shape, form, or fashion. And you're about to realize that through the paid service. And maybe in other ways for some of you guys. But you're trying to give her the benefit of the doubt. But you realize she's not initiated into the spiritual realm. She really is not of the light. You're about to expose her. Um, for some, she could be a parent because we have guardian on the bottom of the deck. For some, she, I mean, not on the bottom, on the bottom of this. I'll show you. For some, she could be um, a parent, possibly, because we have the guardian card. Um, possibly. Have child or children, possibly. For some, maybe not. For, or for some, it might be your mother or your father. Possibly. Well, she's femme energy. So I think she might have kid or kids is what I'm saying. Possibly.
Okay, I didn't hear anything else. I didn't hear anything else. All right, you guys. Um, let me pull one animal spirit and then I'll close it. Spirit messages you have for me. And one of you is about to get extremely bad vibes off her energy. Extremely bad vibes. And you are right. Know this. Okay, I heard it. One of you are about to get extremely bad vibes off her energy. Extremely bad vibes. Know this. So, um, some kind of bad, bad vibe energy um, off her energy soon. This is upcoming, it sounds like, in the universe if that message applies for you. Um, sounds like this one hasn't happened yet. Um, sounds like you're about to go visit her or provide her services or just go visit her, period. However, that resonates. And you're about to get bad vibes off her energy. So, um, y'all know the song, the 311 song? Amber is the color of her energy. Oh, that's what it reminds me of. He said, this chick ain't got no amber color energy. Um, and I'm just being for real, for real. Um, most certainly not. Um you're about to get very bad vibes her aura is not amber i'll tell you that nor is it orange um because we did an orange aura reading in here last night um i don't know what color her aura is but it's not amber or orange i'll tell you that okay so we pulled hawk reversed for one you know this person has tried to entrap somebody and for one, you're about to expose that too. Oh my Lord, I heard for one of you guys, you know somebody, this person has tried to entrap somebody. And yeah, she's definitely dark arts. But she's trying to entrap people and taking people's money and not even giving them clear services. Um, frauding people and blase, blase, blase. Then yeah, she's definitely dark side for sure. But um, one of you guys know she's tried, um, she's tried to entrap somebody and for one, you're about to expose that too. Now, however you're about to expose that, I don't know if that's social media. I don't know if that's a call to the police, a call to the feds or a call to somebody else. If it's a child she tried to entrap, is it, hopefully that's a call to child protective services. Um, but she tried to entrap someone, whether it was a child or, uh, an adult or maybe both. Um, so if it's a child, I would hope you call child protective services and the police. If it's a child, she tried to entrap. If it's an adult, um, I don't know who you're going to call the police or feds or what have you. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, but the entrapment energy I'm feeling is, uh, with the hawk reversed energy, it could be an air sign this person is, or they could have air in their chart, or you could be an air sign. However, that resonates and applies in one's life or just taking on the, she was taking on the air sign reverse energy of trying to entrap somebody and basically stealing your damn money and not even giving you accurate services. Entrapment of money energy, entrapment of a person or a child energy, because I didn't hear if it was an adult or a child she was trying to entrap. Um, Hawk reverse is basically um, delaying rights, liberties, and freedoms. Um, upright, it's freedom, justice, liberty, justice for all kind of energy. Hulk upright is. Reverse, it's delaying, entrapments, delays, um, uh, blockages, um, entrapment, um, trying to stagnate somebody um, by stealing their money and not even providing them accurate services or entrapping person, adult-wise or child or children. Um, delaying Rights, freedoms, and liberties, basically, is Hawk Reverse. And like I said, you could be an air sign, they could be an air sign, or not. Um, but that is definitely the energy of this person, for sure, for sure, for sure. Whoever this person is and how they apply. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. If they are an air sign or you are an air sign, you could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius in your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Feminine, Hebrew, Jupiter charts, or they could. However, that resonates. Okay, I didn't hear anything else. All right, I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices and namaste.